This video is not for the sensitive hoes. The ones who can't take anyone else's opinions except for their own. If you can't have a mature conversation, then darling, this video is not for you. You will be blocked immediately. Now remember to keep it cute, keep it mute, or get the boot. Now preparing to nanny port to Nina's raw view. In 3, A2, A1. Hey guys, it's me, Nina, Bonina, Banana, Fasana, Osama, Bin Laden, Brown, and welcome back to my raw view. Ooh, let me come in closer so you can see the mug. Well, get into her. Ooh, ah, oh. But before I go on, remember, this is the place where you come to keep it cute, keep it mute, or you will get the boot. Okay? Meaning, come here, share your opinions. I'm all here for your opinions. As long as they're respectful, delightful, and intelligentful. Or if you can't do that, you will be blocked and chopped. Immediately. But welcome back to the rest of my piggies. P-I-G, oink, oink, pigs are great. Petty is great. What's up in this house? If you're gonna come to this house, you gotta put on a blouse. What you gonna do when you come to this house? Oh. I'm acting like it's early, but it's late. When you have to trick yourself so you can get through the raw view. Well, yeah, thank you guys for coming back. This is another episode of season 14. Snatch game, I hear. About time it's snatch game. Some people were trying to spoil that nobody goes home. Please, when you come here, don't spoil anything. Like, if you choose to go to Reddit and spoil yourself, keep it to yourself. Like, stop trying to be some newscaster. Like, well, it's like, like, keep it to yourself. Some people like to be surprised. So I'm hoping they're wrong, um, but whatever. Girl, I'll tell you this wig is so painful. Like it's so pretty. Y'all are gonna hear all the beads, all the beads. I'm sorry. <laughs> You're gonna hear it all. But yeah, I ordered this wig not too long ago just to do that damn Mary Jane all night long. I'm gonna give it to you, give it to you, give it to you, give it to you. Girl, cause it, this, the least thing used to rock this hairstyle. So yeah, anyway, it's painful. <laughs> but beauty is pain. Um, I don't have any weird news or anything um, that I can think of. But what we can do, like, you know, my hang or bang. Ooh. This is gonna be a tough one for me. Cause I'm not doing anybody who I think is like not attractive per se. You know, everybody's everybody's somebody in somebody's eye, you know, but um this is gonna be a hard one. The hanger bang this week, and as you know, if you're gonna play the game, you have to choose one. There's no both da -da -da, one. The hanger bang is going to be. Let me, let me get this out of the way so you so you can really see. Jason Momoa or Jean-Claude Van Damme. Damn, you sexy. Oh, 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 oh. The doll fell over. I was moaning too hard, bitch. <laughs> oh, oh, girl, what, a, what is a girl to do? What is a girl to do? Cause Jean-Claude Van, damn you sexy. Girl, some of y'all know that man, that man. I remember when my straight friends, back in the day when I had, when I was not sure what I was. Anyway, they used to, him and his dad used to love watching the Jean-Claude Van Damme movies. And I would watch them with them. And they'll be looking at all the girls. Cause he has some pretty girls in his movie. 
and I'll be looking at Jean, girl, Jean, girl, his butt. Jean Claude Van Damme has to have one of the sexiest behinds I have ever seen, and he can do that whole Chinese split, not a sideways mystique split. <laughs> Love you, girl. But the whole split in the booty cheeks. And he always, per oh, sorry. He always purposely showed his butt. Oh, he knew I wanted it. He knew I did. Who would have known I was a top back in the day? Oh, but Jason Momoa. Y'all know how I feel about Jason, girl. Y'all know. That man, that's a man. That's a man. Okay. Jean-Claude Van Damme has not aged that great to me in the face. Jason, I'm sure he's older now. He still seems like he's looking good in the face. Ooh! Ah! If this was years ago, my answer would be Jean-Claude Van Damme. I'm, ah! Ah! I'm gonna choose Jason? Oh my God! I'm gonna choose Jason. Jean but Jason, I'm gonna cheat on you every now and then with Jean-Claude Van Damme. I feel so bad because he's my original husband. That's my answer. So who do you guys choose? That has been hang or bang. So let's go ahead and read some comments. Um, the lip syncs were excellent. This is from last week's episode with Jasmine and Georges. I just wish they would uh, perform to a get on up. Get on up. Get on up. Everybody know girl, that's a drag queen anthem, bitch by Kathy Brown or keep pushing. Oh, keep pushing. Oh, now I know. Daryl, what do you know about that song? What do you know? Keep pushing on. Things are gonna get better. It won't take long. Keep on pushing to the top. Oh, yes, man. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to hear that song before I start raw viewing. Right, I don't know why Drag Race does not do drag, like house, kind of songs i don't understand rupaul should know about all these old school house songs like girl he's from back in the day like like surely they can get copyright to, to those songs because they're not really like like songs that they play on the radio like girl please play us some drag song imagine they would have like lip sync to get on up i know oh my god i'm living for the check it so when is the album dropping or only fans speaking of i like to be plowed I like to be plowed. Do you want to plow me? Yeah, I like plowing you. I like to be plowed. Yeah. I like to be plowed. I like to be I plowed. I like plowing you. Boy. I like to be plowed. Daddy. Boy. What did mommy say? Son, can't you see? I'm really in there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fish and chips. Atta boy. You're welcome. There's not even a point to the gold bar if they are going to have episodes with double Shantae's or others where no one goes home. But I guess Rue has to make that money. True. Like I thought the point of the gold bar was to save people, but they already been saving people. So what's the point? I guess we'll find out the point when they need to save their favorite. Okay. This is somebody who, once again, people that just don't understand what a joke is or just take things just a little too literal so you know how i say tipping it's not a country in china like we all know it's just something dumb to say well most of us know this hi nina fyi china is a country and it has 23 provinces there is no separate countries in china hong kong and maku are occupied territories tipping is not a city in china um, I think I know these things, which is why it's just joke and foolery. It's not meant to be taken serious. You didn't have to give me a geography class. Some of you people, I would hate to see y'all at a comedy show or hang with y'all and have fun. I can picture I can picture these people being at a stand-up show routine, and the comedians like. Hey, yo, why did the chicken cross the road? Why did the chicken cross the road? And then here they go. Excuse me, kind sir. Excuse me. First off, 
chicken can't cross the road. Boo! <laughs> you see what I mean? It's foolish. Nina, you need to reach out to them and pay for a booth essentially. But if you organize yourself with merch, it's an enormous money making opportunity and great way to get your face in front of thousands of new fans. I'm like, but honestly, I don't think they hold grudges. This is when I was saying how Tamisha like said that wow, I guess spoke of her and how they were like, I guess pretty much apologizing away and now she wants now she's going to drag on. Zachary, I appreciate you, but I'm not reaching out to Drag Race. No shade. I really feel like they should reach out to me because they're the ones who've been doing me dirty. They're the ones who've been not giving me the opportunities when it comes to doing drags, drag race related things. They're the ones who bitch black hit what when they when they cared about black lives matter and they did that whole thing with all the black drag queens from the show but missed like about one or two or three of us and i was one of them like somehow they missed me even though i made a mark on drag race but for i think they got some new people there some new producers and stuff who just don't like me so yeah i'm not gonna be reaching out to them Stanky and all girl, is that is it that serious? All right, Miss Nina, switching it up on Raw View. The tops turning verse for a man, and I don't know how I feel about it. The way, the way I would be the worst top, I'm low key mad of the power tops that have a turn verse, like it's being a bottom is easy. Tops turning verse and giving bottoms a bad rep, because a mediocre top will def be a messy bottom. Damn, you were mad because I said I would let Jason Momoa top me. Girl, we all know, girl, that I am a top, but back in the day, I started off as a bottom. Girl, just know, somebody's top used to be somebody's bottom. Somebody's bottom is going to end up being a top. Like, that is how it is. <laughs> like, so I know if I was a bottom again, I would know what to do because I know how I used to, used, used to do. Take care of myself, douche, do what I had to do, okay? So that's why I'm good at being a top because I know what it takes to be a bottom girl and make sure y'all check out my uh, uk versus the world finale raw view here's a clip it's me rafiki and welcome back to nina's raw view make sure you check it out and let's go ahead and do some tips thank you april cancade thank you tara spencer thank you love thank you alex xoxo Thank you, JMCL, for the good tip, boo. Thank you, Brian Tavares. Thank you, Vivian McNair. Thank you, Michael Joseph. Thank you so much. Thank you, Thomas Gigolo. Thank you, boo. Thank you, Dan Walton, to get some out of country. <laughs> thank you. Thank you, Robert, for the good tip, love. Thank you so much. And thank you, Anita Ayala. La, 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 la. Thank you, boo. Thank you, Flavia. Flavia Flavia Periotti. Thank you for the good tip. Thank you, April, April Hamilton. Thank you. Thank you, Jamie Garabay Jr. Thank you, Garabi. Garabe. Thank you, Carlos Alva. Thank you, Steve Romero for the good tip, love. Thank you, Carlos Alva again, boo. Thank you, Yolanda Dixon. And thank you, Derek Pollock for the biggest tip this week. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And remember, guys, if you like the tip, please do because there's a costume that I want to get for another Raw View. So yeah, remember all the tipping information is in the description box down below. Thank you guys so much. Mwah. Let's go ahead and get to this raw view. Am I irritated there's eight of us here still? Absolutely. Same. I think we all are. <laughs> Deja, just say it, girl. You know you did better. Like, a lot of people think that you were robbed this last episode. I feel like, and I, I am getting to the point now where I feel like, like I said... They know how we kind of will react because we do the whole psych evaluation. And they probably just wanted Deja to have this kind of moment. Because there's no reason why she shouldn't have won. Honestly, and that's, and that's no shade to Bosco, but I really feel like Deja really kept the group going. She was very quick and witty with it. Um, And it's like, if she ain't won by now, yeah, she has reason to be worried. <laughs> They're so shady. Girl, not even them cutting off Jasmine. Shading. Shut up. Yeah, Rue. Lead Little Richard to Kennedy Davenport. <laughs> to use bubble wrap inspired by bubbly, sparkly. So the girls have to do their mini challenge is bubble wrap couture. 
I'm crying, crying. Let's see who won this mini challenge, girl. <laughs> I'm at Angeria's dress. Actually looks good besides the one part falling down, showing her hip. But I'm like, come on, make an old nasty kind of gown out of bubble wrap. Ew. <laughs> I can't with this little ponytail looking like some grown baby. I can't. She's doing the worm. She's going to do the snake. Oh. Okay. Come on for the drapery and stuff. We're doing bubble wrap. Not too bad. Well, something tells me Jasmine will still be a top when she fully transitions. <laughs> Bosco. So Bosco won. Okay, she's on a roll, girl. Was it the best out of everybody? Well, who cares? It's just a mini challenge. <laughs> We're playing the snatch game. Okay, so the girls are doing snatch game. They're snatching and gaming. Okay. Choices. Selena and Aubrey Plaza. Selena or Aubrey Plaza? Hmm. What would you do for Selena though? I just had a dark joke in my head, but I'm not gonna say it. <laughs> what would you do though? Seriously, like Selena, you know, did seem this did seem fun and cheerful, but like, what would be her personality? What would you give her? I'm really curious. Now, whatever you've done with Crystal Method. Uh -huh. I know she wouldn't be like, Bro, stop comparing me to Crystal. But she don't want to get fired. I am doing Tammy Brown. Wait. Tammy Brown? <laughs> now, I thought people would allegedly hate when we do other drag race girls but not Angeria doing a white queen Tammy girl I gotta see this <laughs> Daya really can't stand Jasmine leave that girl alone did he just say he's doing little John yes <laughs> I, the girls are doing some ballsy choices, girl. Now the girls have to do a spiritual holy runway. Oh Lord, this is gonna be so blasphemous. Oh God. <laughs> the girls are shady. Six hours and a lot of duct tape. Raven looks crazy here. <laughs> I'm sorry she does. Like, she looks like a damn evil duck. Girl. This bronze, this, this stuff is too much. William Shakespeare. Okay, like, I don't... I, I feel like, okay, if you're gonna do William, do William. Like, like look like William. Look like, a, like, be a guy. Like, be William. For my opinion, but... Okay. You pick whatever school you want to go to. See ya. Oh Lord. Jasmine's gonna be in the bottom. Okay, I'm sorry, but no. <laughs> you look nothing like Tammy, like at all. It's not even just because you're black. You just look nothing like Tammy. And you are just coming off as a crazy person. Like, Tammy's crazy, but like, you, this could be anybody. <laughs> RuPaul, I am so excited to meet you. <laughs> I can kind of see Drew, but she definitely had, has the way she speaks down. <laughs> E.T. phone my home. Oh, Lord. Okay, I know Deja's mixed, but I swear this is giving me white guy trying to be black, but he definitely just sounded just like Lil Jon. And I'm focusing more on my She's supposed to be Gwyneth Paltrow, but she sounds more like Sasha Valor. Okay. I don't see Ozzy at all. <laughs> this definitely could be some random rock guy, but not Ozzy. Do you read the Bible? 
Bible regularly? Every day. I read the Bible, chicka fire fool. Uh, only a few people would know what the hell that is. <laughs> Starring in the Little John show. I'm glad Bosco said that because I'm like, girl, this has to be one of the weakest snatch games in the season, to be honest. Which is surprising because, you know, everybody was saying how good these girls are at these acting challenges. And I'm like, yeah, it's a little lackluster. And Daisha is carrying the whole thing. So if she don't win this bitch, Riga Morris. I heard that he shakes children. Oh! <laughs> I thought that was funny. Not shake your children. <laughs> Not in nature. In nature. <laughs> Thank you, Wanda Sykes. Oh. <laughs> ah, and I call him Wanda Sykes. I can't. I worship mushrooms because. Your holy couture costume is mushrooms because you worship mushrooms. Yeah, people worshiping false idols. But those are the ones that normally go far. Illuminati. Girl, not cat balls. Mm, 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 mm. And damn his feet big. You know what that mean? It means it's time for beauty and looks with Nina Bonina Brown. I'm Rick James, bitch. And that has been Beauty and Looks with Nina Bonina Brown. Oh, Dan RuPaul wearing a lot of these kind of like dresses with a slit. This one I don't really care for, the slit in the middle. Yeah, it's okay. Right. And that, something about the makeup, she does look pretty, but I feel like they, they it's a little too natural. She looks older here, she does. But um, I will... I'll put it on layaway. So Deja, uh, I was hoping she was going to come out with something really, really sickening to go with her sickening snatch game. Um, I still think she's going to win tonight. I don't really care for this. I don't know what holy it is, but you know, to each his own. <laughs> I will. I don't really care for it like that. Honestly, I don't. Unfortunately. So Jasmine worships astrology. Yeah, God, it's over. <laughs> um, but I'm gonna buy this. It's cute. I mean, it still it still looks holy to me. I'm gonna buy it. Let the church say amen for Angelia. Finally, somebody does something that I look at and be like, okay, this is holy. <laughs> this is that church lady at church, girl. Girl, Andrea look an old auntie, bitch. <laughs> but it's pretty, though. I'm going to buy this. I'm going to buy this look, even though I dang, I really genuinely don't think this has nothing to do with the, with the theme. I know she said she worships mushrooms, but... I mean, I think you just like them, but you like you're just you're worshiping them. Like, uh, no, but I'm gonna buy the look, even though it doesn't really meet the requirements for me. Diabetic. you do not want to cross this. I don't think I care for this that like that. I don't think I do. Not really. It's okay. It's all right. Yeah, I don't really care for it. I'm not gonna really buy it or rent it. I saw the shoe at the bottom, girl. I've been through that. I know exactly, girl. When that platform, when the part comes unattached from the heel part. Oh, I have a video of that. <laughs> exactly. That was secretly God saying, stop playing with me. Straight from six hot sold out weights at Vatican. Okay, sexy Vatican. I'm going to buy this. <laughs> sexy, sexy Vatican. La da dee. Praise the Lord. <laughs> I'm, I don't like this theme. I'm sorry. And I know a lot of people here don't believe in God, don't believe in anything. Y'all believe in drag queens. I get it. Um, but um, no, when I think about worship, holy runway, bitch, why are you? First, I just don't like when people worship 
false idols and just wor fake, just worshiping people. Like you're just worshiping a fellow human being that's just like you. Like why are you worshiping them? You worship the Spice Girls? That's who you give thanks to when you wake up in the morning? <laughs> I can't, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Like the, the look is cute. I'll rent the look, I guess, but I'm just like, none of these girls are really giving me anything except for like one, one or two. <laughs> sorry. <sighs> okay, at least she's giving me like a nun, at least. But girl, boy, I'm sorry, boy, in this bodysuit. I'm sorry. <laughs> and I'm not talking about the trans part. That's no. No, we're not talking about the trans part. We're not talking about that. But right now you're on drag race giving me drag, allegedly. And I just see boy body. I'm sorry. And it, it has nothing to do with body shaming because... I'm a slim person. I'm skinny. But if you're going to uh, give me a, an illusion, give me an illusion. Give it to me. Sell the garment. No. I'm just not going to buy a rent. I'm tired of the girls not padding. Sue me. Fight me. Deja won. Congratulations, girl. Even though you should have won last week, too. But congrats. All of the girls are up for elimination. Here goes another shenanigan, some more stunts. <sighs> Lip sync for your mother tucking lie. Oh Lord, is this another waiting for it tonight? Night, night <laughs> with all the girls <laughs> and honey on the floor like a goddamn Beetleborg roach spinning around barefooted. Oh gosh. So nobody's going home. Now they have to do a lip sync, La La Perusala, Smackdown. I mean, was this all this plan in the first place? I'm so sick of it. <sighs> anyway, good night. <laughs> I'm so over it. Thank you guys for coming to watch my raw view. What do you guys think about this foolery? Like, it's just not even, it's, like, it's to the point where it's just like, let it be over already. It's not even fun. It's just like, okay. Trying too hard to make all this drama happen for no reason. Anyway, besides that, what do y'all think of the Snatch Game? Do y'all think it was the best, the worst, mediocre? What do you think? Let me know down below respectfully. Thank you guys for coming here. And I love you guys as always, sweetie. And remember to stay beat. To stay beautiful. But most importantly, darling, stay blessed. Kima Cho or... Kamochi. <laughs> Bye. Hey, it's your girl Diamond over here at Club Latrell. Mother gonna do me a song. Hey, check that she gonna stick. Hey, that she gonna stick. Yeah, Benji fish, Benji fish. You know, real. Thanks. What's the problem? Come on, I'll take you home. <laughs>